Windows Crash Course, Windows 10, R. Craig Collins, Copyright 2015. Windows 10 Crash Course Overview, Desktop, Start Menu, Search, Action Center, This PC, File Explorer, Change Icon Size, Don't Hide Extensions, Properties, Map Network Drive, Zipping Files, Control Panel, Settings. This presentation assumes you have some basic experience with Windows 7. Windows 10 Crash Course Start Menu. Left click Start Menu to browse apps. Right click Start Menu for Tools. Click Start icon and start typing to search. You may right click an item to pin to the start menu. Click all apps to scroll through installed programs. Windows 10 Crash Course Cortana. If your computer has a microphone and speakers, you may click on the Cortana microphone icon and simply say what you are searching for. Try, what's the temperature? Right now, it's 85 and partly sunny. Tell me a joke. What do you call two crows on a branch? Attempted murder. Tell me a joke. Don't trust the atoms. They make up everything. Tell me a joke. Why do sharks live in salt water? Because pepper water makes them sneeze. Windows 10 Crash Course Task View In addition to using Alt-Tab to scroll through open windows, You can click the Task View icon. Windows 10 Crash Course Quick Launch Items pinned to the taskbar show up in the Quick Launch area to the right of the Task View icon. Pinning too many items to the taskbar can crowd the display of programs that are running. Windows 10 Crash Course Taskbar To the right of the Quick Launch area is the part of the taskbar that shows you what programs you have started. You can use the Task View icon to see thumbnail views of the windows if the icons on the taskbar are not giving you enough information. Again, Having too many items pinned leaves less room for icons of running programs. Windows 10 Crash Course Notifications The System Notification Area, or the tray, indicates what programs Windows has started. If there are several running, not all may display. But the caret icon to the left of the tray will open a larger window. Arrows mean more options in Windows. Windows 10 Crash Course Desktop Peak To the extreme right side of the taskbar is a rectangular box-shaped hotspot. Pointing at that box will let you peek at the desktop. Clicking that box will minimize all windows and switch to the desktop. Note, click the time and date for Big Clock 
calendar. Windows 10 Crash Course, Action Center. Click the Action Center icon to the left of the clock. From here you get alerts, such as updates, notifications, such as new email, to quickly access settings, or to go into tablet mode. Tablet mode uses touch screen gestures rather than a keyboard and mouse. Windows 10 Crash Course. This PC, File Explorer. In Windows XP, the tool to browse files was called My Computer, or Windows Explorer. In Windows 7, the tool to browse files was called Computer, or Windows Explorer. Starting in Windows 10, the same tool was called This PC, or File Explorer. The next section will cover how to change icon viewing size, how to stop hiding extensions, how to view properties, and how to zip compress files to start this PC. Choosing the icon on the taskbar for File Explorer, right-clicking the Start button, and choosing File Explorer, clicking the Start button, and choosing File Explorer. How to change icon viewing size. Select View and choose from the options or at the lower right hand corner. Select the Details view or the Icon view. How to stop hiding extensions. On the View tab, make sure file extensions are selected. Windows 10 Crash Course, this PC. To view properties or map a network drive. Open this PC if not already open. If you don't see the Computer tab, 1. Click on this PC on the left margin. 2. Select the Computer tab. Three. Click either icon for properties. Details to follow. 4. Click to Map Drive. Don't use Map Network Drive unless you know its use. This just points out where to find it. How to View Properties Select an item. Properties display at the bottom. Choose the Properties icon or select this PC, choose an item, and select Properties. How to zip compress files or folders. Select the item or items you wish to zip. To add to your selection, hold down the Control key and select again. Right click one of the selected items. Choose Send To. Select Compressed Zipped Folder. You may rename the file or right click Choose Rename to rename the file at a later time. The fastest way to open the control panel, right-click the Start on the left of the taskbar. Many items that used to be in the control panel are now in Settings. The fastest way to get to Settings is to click the Action Center icon on the right side of the taskbar. For tablet users, press and hold the Start or swipe from the right for the Action Center. Thanks for watching.